Hello everybody and welcome to this week's edition of Inside Warhawk Football. I'm here with head football coach Kevin Bullis and coach congrats on your first win of the season against Carthage. Alex Pete tied a school record with four rushing touchdowns and he did it all in the first half. What kind of impact does the rushing attack have on your offense? It opens up the passing attack. And then, you know, we've uh, Warhawk football, one of the traditions that we've always had is a balanced attack. You know, people, you know, I would say to people, hey, we're a 50-50 run pass team. That doesn't mean we're going to come out of every game and there's going to be 50% run, 50% pass. But ultimately, the premise behind that is not being one-dimensional. And, and the run game really opens up the pass game. And, and that's really ultimately when people got to worry about, um, you know, Alex Pete and Jalen Edmondson running the ball on them. That's going to open up opportunities for Max and, and, and those wide receivers, Kumaro and Delaney and all those guys. And this week you play Salisbury, a team ranked in the top 10 in Division Three. What area do the Warhawks need to focus on the most preparing for Salisbury Seagulls? Salisbury Seagulls are a very disciplined team, very disciplined program, which really fits with their triple option offense. And, and they're, very, they're a three, four defense, and, and they're gonna put great players on the field. Those great players are gonna play fast. They're gonna keep the game simple. Kind of sounds a lot like us. The one thing that's different with them is they are one dimensional with their running game. And if they're able to run the game, if they're able to execute their um, triple option offense in a manner they want to, we're going to be in a world of trouble. If we're able to play great run defense, which we take a lot of pride in, um, then, it's gonna, then, then things will bode well for us. And Warhawk seniors seem to step up every season in big moments. Which position group do you expect to have the biggest jump moving forward? You know, I think when you really look at, um, we're very fortunate with talent that really at, at all positions and, and uh, whether it's running back or D-line or, you know, DBs, but really the group that when I look at a group that can be extremely impactful is that wide receiver group. That, that, that room is so talented when you think about Ryan Wisniewski, um, Derek Kumaro, um, Sam Delaney, Ty Holty, I mean... <laughs> Yada, yada, yada. I mean, there, there's a lot of people I can add into that list. And, and I think that's the room that, uh, to me, as this season progresses, you're going to see a lot of names, a lot of people come up with some huge plays. Coach, thanks for your time. I appreciate you being here with me as always. Thank you, Sam. Really enjoyed it. This has been this week's edition of Inside Warhawk Football on UWW-TV.